first time that I'm speechless. Wow, guys, I can't tell you what an amazing reception. What an amazing run we had and are still having. Thank you. First and foremost, I'd like to thank the Mets, Fred, Jeff, and Saul. And a special thanks to, to Nelson Doubleday, who's no longer with us. So it's definitely a part of my coming here. The Mets are in my prayers. I'm pulling for them. I love this team. I think the future looks good. And we are going to pull for them and get this team to the next level, right? Yeah. for giving me this award. I'm very, very proud to be a New York Met, and I love to leave it on the field, and I'm glad they, they took recognition and gave me this honor. Thank you. I mean, Tom, who's not here today, what an amazing history, and what a story organization. And the one thing I noticed about the Mets is that not only did they have great players, and these guys are great players, but they're all great guys, too. So God bless them. Thank you, guys. Bobby and Johnny and Al and all the other guys, we had a lot of fun. They made it easy for me. It took pressure off me. Fonzie was one of the best clutch hitters that I played behind. And I said to myself, if I wasn't the guy up there with the game on the line, I wanted to be Fonzie. Because I knew he came through, sometimes a lot more than I did. So he took a lot of pressure off me, man. God bless you, man. I'd like to say special thanks to Danny Lozano, my agent. I know agents don't always get the best uh, rap today, but maybe because he drove a hard bargain with the Dodgers, I ended up in New York, so maybe we should... <laughs> Special friends that came here today, thank you. The Mets were gracious to bring in a lot of my friends, and I appreciate it very much. Thank you to give them this day. She was there every step of the way. Thank you, Mom. I love you. To my brothers. They're just cool guys. They, they were with me every step of the way. They gave me so much love and support. And we all know what family's all about, right? And they were there unselfishly, coming to visit me in the minor leagues. Anytime I needed them, they were there. So thank you, guys. I love you. see the good things about me, but she's got to live with me, so <laughs> keep a prayer for her, because I'm not the easiest guy to live with, and she's given me the most special gift, and that's my daughter, Nicoletta, and Paulina. <laughs> and my son, Marco, 
who said a little young couldn't make the journey, but I'll tell you what, I'm going to teach him how to hit, and the rest is up to him. I just told Jeff I'm going to give the Mets the crack, first crack at him, but he's not going to be cheap. <laughs> Thank you, honey. I love you. I love you very much. Woo! You know what? Too, Mike. They say that you can count your true friends on one hand. This is where you guys are. Right here. Special memory, your most special memory. And yeah, we hit some great home runs and had some great games and some great teams. But the, the relationship we've had, the love that we shared, and the love you've given me and the support is something I cannot tell you. Words cannot describe how special it is to me. So God bless all of you very much. Thank you. night she said one thing she said what do you think would be the, the moment that would define and I thought a little bit and I could have said maybe a home run or a big hit but when I came back here in 2006 with San Diego you guys cheered for me yeah. and you pulled for me and that just shows what we have and what we have shared family, all your friends, and God bless the Mets. Thank you. Somebody's gonna ring my bell. Oh, 